Yeah. Right, next we've got things to the clubhouse anyway, let's. And do you know where he put the golf balls into his pocket like that? You see, and he looked into the clubhouse and he was getting a drink. And he was inside anyway, this lovely lady he was looking at him. She was looking down, you see. You know, like. And he see, of course, was the golf ball she was talking about. And uh, he said, he, he said, oh, just golf balls. And he said, she said, ooh, she said. That must be so, she said. I tin a cent for myself. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, next, no, he got so good at paying the golf, he ended up over moving to Scotland. Lads, he was over in Scotland and he, went, he was playing the golf over and he decided that he'd join St Andrews, you know, and he'd be moving out like that. He joined St Andrews Golf Club and he was, you know, signing up membership. Was it in there? Everyone they let him there at all? No. And he was signing up for membership and he went going and they were saying name, Max, um, surname, Golden, very good, your address, whatever, age, whatever, all was filling out good tournaments, all was filling out great. Religion. Religion, he said, what has my religion got to do with it? She said, now it's on the form. She said, you know, we have to just fill out what's on the form. Religion. Well, he said, Jewish. <laughs> And she said, oh, she said, there could be a bit of a problem. <laughs> he said, what do you mean there could be a bit of a problem? He said, for God's sake, what has my religion got to do with Johnny a golf club or not? And uh, she said, well, do you know, on ceremonial days over here in Scotland, you have to wear, do you know, the full regalia, the full kilt and the whole lot, you know. He said, it's fine. He said, sure, I'm fine, pair of legs. I wouldn't mind wearing a kilt at all. <laughs> oh, she said, no, and you don't realise that you'd have to go, you know, Oh, look. Everything. Nothing on inside. He said, that's great. She said, your ventilation is mighty odd. I said, no problem with that at all. Oh, she said, there might be a bit of a problem now since you're Jewish. He said, what in the name of God has that got to do with it? When she said, when you're Jewish, I presume you would have been circumcised. <laughs> and he looked at her and he said, oh, well, he said, I've helped it all. I have heard it all. No, he said. I knew, he said, you'd have to be a Catholic to be a Catholic. He said. I knew you'd have to be a Protestant, he said, to be in the other job. But I never knew you'd have to be a complete prick to join a God.